I'm here in Prague at PHP Central and Europe talking about what's new in PHP. We are releasing a new version of PHP coming up in within the month, PHP 7.3, with a couple of new features, flexible here doc and a couple of others, but more importantly, some better optimization in the opcode cache, dead code elimination and SCCP work. So expect to see 5 to 10% performance boost over PHP 7.2. I'm quite excited about being here at, at in Prague at, at this conference. I like the fact that we pull together people from many countries. We can expose PHP to, to that many more users and countries um, and people get together also and, and see what other PHP developers are doing in, in other nearby countries. So I, I think these events are very, very valuable to, to the PHP community as a whole and to me as well. I always learn a lot from these conferences. I, I learn what the pain points are for people I hear all the, the horror stories and things that have gone right as well and, and things that have gone wrong, people who have tried to upgrade but couldn't for whatever reason and all this information goes back in as sort of data points into the next versions of PHP and sort of which direction we take things and things that we need to do better. Um, things that we can improve on. So for us, as, as PHP core developers, these events are extremely useful, but I think they're even more useful to, to the attendees that come to these events. Thank you very much for listening to me. This conference was previously known as PHPCon Poland, but now the concept changed and the locations are roaming. So this year it's Prague, next year it's going to be Dresden, and the next year's is still open for new cities. This year's PHP Central Europe conference was a special one. We had a great weekend with a lot of great guests. If you are a PHP enthusiast, make sure to join us next year, 2019, in Dresden. I was really, really surprised by the size, the sheer size of the community of developers, PHP developers in the East part of Europe. There's both a huge crowd, large an amount of people, and very various experiences of development, different uh, takes on tools and approaches to uh, process uh, code. So splitting the levels between beginners and, and top. And I think that's really important. That's something that's already available at the CFP level where we actually have to provide and prepare the talk depending on the audience. Um, there are audiences that are beginning or are, I would say, curious. So they want to learn something new, they want to know what happens. They want to do the first step in a new uh, field they haven't uh, tried yet. So it needs to be really wide and, and open. And sometimes you already know about those matters. Um, you want to go deep, you want to meet one of the cutting edge experts, people who really go far and, and beyond anything else. And that needs context. You need to come prepared with experience, with some know-how, maybe some not know-how, things you have missed and you want to fix with those people. And so that really helps choosing the different uh, sessions and what subject you want to learn. I, do, I love all elephants. Um, I brought the, the oldest elephant here to welcome the newest elephant. The real value of the elephant is in the community value. You look at it, you know there's a thriving community behind the elephant, and that's all you need. Going to PHPC is going more than just uh, reaching for experts and uh, knowledge. It means meeting the community, it means meeting people who are sharing both your problems and your ideals, and uh, that's really two days that are intense and from where you learn a lot.
I really enjoyed this conference. Good, good. Speakers are good, uh, especially this man here. Uh, it's been a good show. Food was great. Uh, will you enjoy next year? Uh, yes, I will. Uh, plan to be back. The talks were really high level. I'm really glad that uh, there was uh, a lot of talk about event sourcing and uh, CQRS. Actually, I learned a lot there and probably I will push this solution or whatever to, uh, to some new projects. Uh, and what about Rasmus talk? It was nice. It was uh, really interesting and uh, the way he uh, actually uh, presented uh, the PHP, what uh, he pointed out about the types that, okay, we can do strict typing on everything, but it will impact performance and that's not something we want to do. Thank you guys for the great conference to, in Prague, because uh, in Prague we don't have uh, PHP conferences as much and uh, it's really nice uh, from you to bring your baby from Poland to, to Czech and uh, I really looking forward to next year in the Dresden. I really like the fact that such a monster event went to Prague this year because with Brno PHP we lost a proper PHP conference that would happen in the Czech Republic. I've been doing PHP for a long time, so having a conference in Prague is not only about talks for me, but also about meeting a lot of other people that I don't have a chance to meet for the rest of the years. I went to PHPCon Poland 2016, where I was giving two talks. PHP CE Prague is a little bit different because the PHPCon Poland was in a remote location in the middle of the woods, <laughs> and this is in the city center of Prague. I'm also enjoying the fact that this is the first conference after a long time that I just went as an attendee because I got used to giving talks at conferences. Here I'm just to relax here in my hometown. As many people know, I'm from Brazil. Uh, I need to catch a, a 30 hours flight. So what motivated me to come here was the opportunity to visit a country that nobody knows me, my person, but my work. It was the opportunity to like to show my work to, to the people I barely know, I only know for the internet. About the event, I can say best events I've ever attended because the touch you have with the attendants, the touch you have with the speakers, the touch with everything, everything. So I can say this is the best event in the world. I've ever attended. Congratulations to the organization. I believe the idea of PHPC start to move around the Europe is fantastic because like we know that people usually attend to events close to their house or close to their neighborhood. But like we are in Czech and I just got to know that almost 50% of the people attending are from Poland. Move it to a country to another for a conference, that's that's a really big deal. And I see people and I see the events next year and the next year, the next year moving to other countries and being more more people. I can actually say that in five years, PHPC must become the most big event in Europe, talking about PHP. And like in five years, thousands, two thousand, three thousand people will be like, okay, this year we have PHPC. We don't want to know where it is. I want to be there because it's the best event in Europe. And yes, I, I can actually say that PHPC in a couple of years might become outside Europe because of the quality of the event. So I want to invite you to come next year to Pace PC. Uh, if you are from Europe, I, you should really be there, be here, because I'm from Brazil and I'm here. So if you are from Brazil and I am here, you, you are from Europe, you should be here. Yeah.